Hey guys, Steve Walter, BMW Toyota in Nashville. I always appreciate you guys when you guys do comments, suggestions, things like that, uh, especially when it comes to videos that I can help a lot more people with. So uh, I had a recent comment there. It was actually talking about the rear windshield wiper and washer not working on a uh, Toyota 4Runner. And it's actually a very easy problem to fix, but uh, I guess there's not a whole lot of videos or information out about why it wouldn't work. So um, they actually said they found uh, in one of my other videos the answer to it, but I'm gonna show you just directly why your windshield wiper and washer won't work on a 4Runner. So uh, it's actually up here. So if you kind of take a peek, you can see your wiper is right here, up under the, the area there. So there's a lot of people that think that a 4Runner doesn't have a wiper because you can't see it but this back glass will roll down so since that back glass will roll down you have to put the wiper in a different spot so i'm going to kind of get in here for you all right i'm just going to go ahead and start this vehicle um so what you're going to see is if you kind of look i'm going to kind of get a better position here so turning the steering wheel here so if you look on your windshield wipers uh, your arm right here you'll see rear on the outside so you turn it to intermittent or to on if you turn it up here it's going to be intermittent so uh, if we kind of look back back there you can kind of see it's just kind of rolling here and there if you kick it to on then on just going to keep going back and forth all right so now the other thing i'm going to show you is that if you turn it all the way up like this and hold it for a little bit what you will notice if you look on the back there is that there has been some washer's fluid sprayed on the back. All right, so what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna turn this back off here and I'm gonna note something else. So why might it not work? If you see your window right here, so if you hit this button, usually you hit it pretty hard, you're gonna see that it goes all the way down, right? Pull it, it goes auto all the way up, right? So you don't have to hold it for that. But you have the ability, if you come here and you just barely hit it, so, you have to, I mean, you have to hit it just right. And, all right. So, or pull it up or do something. And you can see the window looks like it's up. All right. If you're, uh, if you walk back to the back here and you take a look, you know, maybe you can tell that you got a little bit of a gap right there. But overall, looking at it, you might not be able to tell that the window is not all the way up thing is though is if you turn your windshield wipers all the way to on you'll notice nothing's happening so it has a function in it that what it's going to do is it's going to stop you from being able to wash or to wipe that window obviously with the window open so how do you fix it well pretty easy <laughs> roll your window up all right and as soon as you roll the window up there's nothing else you need to do but you can see the windshield wiper is going now. So if you're trying to turn that windshield wiper on and it doesn't work, and, and I know I'm long-winded to get here, but I wanted to show you the why as well, but all you need to do is lift your window up and make sure that it's closed and that will usually work it. So, so um, it's not a fuse, it's not something where you're chasing something or anything like that. More often than not, if it doesn't work, that's your reason why. So. Uh, hopefully you guys like that. Definitely like, subscribe. See you guys being in Toyota. Have a great day. Bye.